Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe. Was shot dead. Deputies say they died at the hands of their own father. Ted Dorman is now in jail facing three aggravated murder charges. Their mom's in the hospital shot in the hand. WCPO 9 News reporter Sean Delancey joins us live at that scene in Monroe Township. Sean, this one's a heartbreaker. Yeah, Evan, the Claremont County Sheriff's Department has now released some truly earth shattering details about a shooting rampage here on Laurel Lindell Road that resulted in the deaths of four little boys or three rather little boys. 415 PM, the first 911 call reaches dispatchers. A woman screaming her babies had been shot. The female that went to the firehouse is advising them that the male shot the entire family. Three minutes later, a second caller reports a girl running down the street yelling her father was killing everyone. There are multiple children in the yard. Claremont County deputies arrived to find three young boys, ages three, four, and seven, shot. They say attempts to save them didn't work. Their mother was shot in the hand and taken to the hospital. When it involves children, that's terrible. Neighbors like Dan Thomas are left awestruck by the news such violence shattered their rural community's usual calm. 18-year-old Seth Trees lives a couple houses down. You see this massive police presence up here? Yeah, it, it, it's weird. It's, it's unheard of, you know, crazy. Tell me what it's like around here. It's quiet, you know, people mind their business. Nothing like that ever happens out here. This is a quiet country and very nice area. So to hear this, it's terrible. Deputies say when they arrived, they found Chad Dorman, the kid's father, sitting on the home steps with his boys laying in the yard. He was taken into custody and questioned by detectives. If it gets to the point where you're, you get that mad, I mean, walk away. Don't. In no way harm your your spouse or or your children. I mean, come on, just walk away. Don't, that don't take and don't hurt nobody. Now, Dorman is being uh, or will be spending the night at the Claremont County Jail. Uh, he is expected in court tomorrow at 10 a.m. In Monroe Township, I'm Sean Delancey, WCPO 9 News. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.